what I like about working at Mozameet is that everybody's just so much into this and it feels like we are all kind of trying to make this happen, this huge project. I had this deep love for science fiction, all this kind of stuff, so I started studying aerospace engineering with the goal of going into this like space engineering part, but I kind of realized it's a bit different than I initially imagined. I was aware of cultured meat before, but this was kind of then wandering into the back of my head. I didn't really think about it a lot anymore. And then at just some point, suddenly I was like, okay, this is quite cool actually. And after my studies, I started researching Moza meat to whom I reached out and they were actually looking for somebody similar like me. So it's, it's a bit like destiny, I think, because it was just like matching from both sides. When I started, we were not that many people, around 40. And that sometimes felt a little bit like just a student project. Everybody had to work on different fronts to make things happen. And now we grew a lot, but it still has the spirit of we, we need to, to work together to make this happen. Sometimes it's that so much of the work takes place just in my mind that I really need to, to do something with my hands, something physical to, to get more into a balance. This is also nice about our team that I can also ask for working on things where I can do this. One dream I kind of have is seeing ourselves with the company in a few years building up this big factory where we would actually be able to finally produce big quantities to make a difference to the world. Yeah, it's kind of similar, right? We also do the science fiction type of thing which hasn't been done before. This is kind of also, I think, what brought me to the field of cultured meat, is that it's also something where it's more the pioneering work. There are people saying this is impossible, and this is kind of what I think is even more motivating to prove them wrong.